What's up guys, we are back at it again with The Sims 4. We finally got another expansion pack and now it's The Sims 4 Pets. I mean no, The Sims 4 Cats and Dogs. See now, the only reason why I am a little bit upset and then at the same time not really because this is what we mostly expected to have for The Sims 3 Pets, The Sims 2 Pets, and now that we got The Sims 4 Cats and Dogs, which it could have been just called Pets, you know what, whoever is doing the cover of The Sims 4 and all that extra shit is just, they need to stop right now because it'd be the most simplest. They have, they have one job and they just ruined it. But whatever names that they come up with, I really don't give a shit about because they're just retarded. I don't know why they always do that, but by far the game is getting good reviews. Um, I don't know much about it yet because it hasn't released. Um, lots of, you know, lots of new things are... And there, you get to actually dress your pet now. This is so freaking amazing. Like, and like back in the early days of The Sims, I think he was able to do that. I just don't know how people did it. It was like a mod. Um, and it will also require lots of other things too. And like, you can actually add stuff on it because we do not have the color wheel no more. We cannot do random, pa well, it just showed random patterns. But at the same time, it will not be the same as the other random patterns that they did have at one time. So, yeah, that's something that they brought back to The Sims 4. Um, it's available November 10th. That's actually cool for people who love that. Um, but if you think about it, they didn't put as much work as I thought they were going to do. But, um, you know, The Sims 4 doesn't get work put into it like that. It, the Pets World, I don't think there's going to be like a... I mean, I think there's going to be a map for it. Because as you can see in like the background and stuff, there's like it's a different area. It's like a pet's world or a, a pet's map. And you know, it's crazy how we're not gonna see that beautiful ass map anymore back in The Sims 3 because that whole map was just beautiful. You live there and it's just so nice. The the trees look nice. And now we just got the Sims 4 and we're just gonna get a regular ass map. But it's okay. Because, don't worry guys, we got pets, we got what we all been asking for for like so fucking long. Even though it took like almost five years to make a fucking Sims 4, I mean, of, no, actually four years, almost, yeah, almost four years to just make a Sims 4 pets or Sims 4 cats and dogs. And I'm, I'm just very relieved about that. The pets look, they don't look better. To me, they just look plastic almost. I don't know why they look like that, but... The pets, they look awesome to me. They look more, like, brighter and lit up than the last game. Um, they, they do not look like they have any type of glitches at all. But the game looks good by far. Sims 4 Cats and Dogs. If you want more information, just look on the website. Go watch the video. It'll be down in the description below. See you guys later. And peace.